Why, hello, Nova! Where are you? Come, take a seat. So, I've, uh, heard. You're not doing so well. <laughs> what, what, what do you mean? How are you feeling? Pretty good, pretty good. Are you sure about that? Mm-hmm. Okay, because it says in this book right now that you've been suffering from nightmares, visions, I disembodied voices talking to you. What? Whoa, 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 let's not go, let's not go there, right? You, I don't, I, no, no, I haven't. And where did you hear this? Don't you know? Lucy has told me. L Lucy is, he, he, you know who he is? Of course, why wouldn't I? Wait, but I thought you didn't remember him. You said you... I didn't remember him. He did, cause, cause Lily... Cause you... Wait, but you're... Dying over and over again, what? And you're not supposed to remember Lucius or Lily or any of it. Dying? I've never died before. Wait, I'm confused. That's what Lucius said, do you mean Lucius lied to me? Lucius is not capable of lying. But then what was he telling me? Because he told me you... He probably was just playing around, honestly. He doesn't play around. I've heard him playing around, that wasn't it. He was being dead serious. He even <sighs> wanted me to help you get your memories back. He wanted me to talk to you about the god realm and the old language and all those things, and... Why would he ask me to do that if he wasn't being serious? Maybe C told him wrong, then. Or maybe she told me wrong. <laughs> Who? Oh, either way. C, don't you know? Your friend. I don't... Yes, don't you remember me? What is going on? What is this? She's the one who set up this appointment. She's here? <laughs> I can't be here. I can't be here. I have to go. Um, I can't be Where here. Where are you going? I can't be here. No. She's here. She's not supposed to be here. How did she get in? <laughs> she's she get... always been in. She's- Ever since you entered the server, she's always been in here. Don't you understand? Wherever you go, she follows. I don't want to be here. Now come on, take a seat. No, we're not done no, yet. No, no, no. I don't want to! You can't make me! No, but come on. Look. Why are you like no progress with this and she's really gonna be mad at me? Come on, just sit down. <laughs> so, about those nightmares, do you want to talk about them? Not particularly. And they're not really nightmares, they're just memories of things that have already happened. I'm not particularly worried about it. Are you suffering from forms of PTSD? Probably. What? Well, I haven't. I'm not stressed. Everyone dreams about the stuff that's happened to them. That's kind of, you know, that's normal. <laughs> It's normal. All the time, it's a little bit much. Especially if they're all just bad memories. Well, no, I, I dream about the good ones, too. I have plenty of good memories. You know, my family, my... Um... Okay, yeah, the family's about all that I really... Oh. Well, it sounds like you need a new coping method. About your old coping methods, what were they before? I'm not sure what you mean. Have you been having trouble sleeping? Sleeping? No, what? I'm asleep, aren't I? This isn't real, this can't be real! Of course it's not real! Yes, there's no way Ryu would know about any of this! This isn't actually happening! I'm asleep! Oh, thank god! Oh, you scared me, Dream Ryu! Oh my goodness, alright. This was great, this was fun. I'm gonna wake up now. I'm gonna wake up Clear now. No, you're not. You won't wake up. She won't let you wake up. So I am asleep. Nova, let me explain. We'll be making her way into the server. You have to figure out a solution to keep her at bay. I think that should be the end of our session now anyways. I look forward to seeing you next session, I guess. <laughs> what? what time is it? What is the ungodly noise? Where the, where's that chicken? Wait. Try you! Oh my god, I'm gonna kill him. I swear to god, I'm gonna kill this man. This is definitely not what I wanted to wake up to. Ryu, where are you? Get down here! Get down here! What did you do? What I did know you I come do? In. What in the world? <laughs> There's chickens in my basement. 
What chickens? <laughs> There's chickens in my basement, and they uh, were not I there before. Put any chickens? Oh, the only chickens I know about in your house are the ones that you own. What about the sign that says "Haha, pranked"? Dash R. You know you're the only person on this entire server whose name begins with the letter R. So unless someone new is here, it has to be you. Are you sure that someone's not framing me for this? Do you think Penny or Fuza would do something like this? Do you yes, want to go I see know. the chickens right now? And I don't even want to know what was happening in here. I don't even All want right, to know let's go see this whole in two days. Jesus Christ. Yeah, um, there's let's... actually it's been more than two days. It's been like two months. Oh, for God's sake. So I've wait what I've done again, a lot. again, again, again. Look, you can go see Lindor later, okay? <laughs> see also, Lindor that's new, later. So... What is this? Why are there flags? What did you do? You... It's been two months. <sighs> let's see. One, two, three, Holy... four, five, six, possibly seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen odd chickens in here. Explain this to me. Uh, nothing, or... nothing. Explain it! Explain nope. it! Why I am friends with you, I will never know. Look, it's kind of bored when, like, other people are, like, doing their own thing, and you're sleeping in your house for, like, two months, and I just kind of get lonely, so it's kind of fun to do well, this. Then, you know what? Wake me up! You can wake me up, I don't sleep that hard. Um, I've tried to wake you up before, you're kind of heavy- a heavy sleeper. Either way, maybe, like, I don't know, try harder? I've tried pouring water on you, that doesn't really work. You die doing what?! I'm also surprised you didn't wake up during me trying to threaten you to blow your house up. You threatened I mean, to what? blow my house up when I was sleeping? No. Are you insane? <laughs> Speaking of explosions, what the hell is this? What Please. in the world is this? What? What does it say? Mm, wow. What sign? There was no sign there. I uh, there was totally a sign there. You know, I've been meaning to ask you what the hell the whole deal with this painting is. What painting? Come up to your bedroom. Oh, I have no idea. It just appeared one day, but I've been so busy I figured it was easy to just ignore it. Is that a name tag? What? I, I swear to god there was a name tag up there. Are they pulling the same move with me? Like, in <gasps> Oh my god! Wait, what? Oh my god, there's a room back here. Why is there a room back um, here? I didn't build this. I, I think swear. there's more than a room? Is there- is this the hat that appeared on my house? The hat wasn't a hat, so. it was a house. I thought you built this. I thought you no. built a hat back here. Why would I build something on your house? Because you do things like that all the time. So then if you didn't build this, who built this? Oh my god. What kind of a cult is this? Um. Hi, hello, who are you? Hi. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. No, I was I just, I was just I airbnb being. Who are you and why are you in my house? You didn't get the mail that I was, that I signed the contract for the Airbnb. No. What mail are you talking about? What the, what's an Airbnb? Um, it's, it's this thing where you're in the air. It's like an air. It's kind of like a hotel, Nova. You know how I have no, a Linder no, no. hotel? It's no. like that, but I think, I no. think you're doing it illegally. No, no, you're wrong. I'm in the air, in this hat, and we're being being we're we're brewing and baking. Please leave my house. Yeah, I'm please just leave. leave. No, don't abandon oh. me. This could be a serial killer. No, I'm not a murderer. I was just, I was, I was practicing my rituals for a meditation and yoga. Oh, I have a question. Oh, How did you get in? I signed the contract for the Airbnb. I was aired here, you know. Which teleported. contract and who gave it to you? So Nova, this, your name's Nova, right? Yeah. That's what it said on the return address. And I got the contract, and so I thought that it would be okay. Don't give uh, me diamonds, I don't want that. Oh. Do you know where you are? Do what? you know how long you've been here? Oh, oh, you yeah, know, just a few years. A few years? A few months, I think, I think you mean. Sorry, it kind of skips me. You know, watches don't help. <laughs> she sounds like you. Can you I leave? was listening to you guys. Follow me. No, I'll show you why I can't leave. Let's go onto this tree. We can't leave because there's a barrier. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that's everyone's right. trapped oh. here. Well, well anyway, look, look how nice my house looks. I, I will say, the person whose name I don't know, you definitely improved Nova's house. No, you did not! Thank it you. looks weird! It's purple! Why is it purple? Are you saying purple's a bad name? A bad purple. name? Is your is name purple? purple? This. This. Here's some pie. I don't it's want pie. pie! You know how I said brew and bake? See, pie and ah! brew. What? Who are you? What's your name? Ryu. Ryu. That's a fun yeah. name. Who are you exactly? Name. Oh! Oh, my name's Sarita. S E R I T A. Why are you covered in ketchup? Yeah. Oh, that's yeah, that's ketchup. Um, that's ketchup. How'd you get I ketchup? We don't even have tomatoes. And how the hell did you obtain that trident? There was this weird guy who was blue and green. And he was like oh. drowned. And then he tried to hit me, and then I was like no. So I smacked him in the face, and he died. 
And now, I have this trident. So you basically killed a drone that had a trident and stole its trident. Also, Nova, are you writing anything? Am what I? is up with these? I don't know what Ooh, this is. I didn't put wait. this there. Look at his coordinates oh, in it. Right. Well, um, good luck babysitting. What? What? Babysitting? No, I'm not babysitting this child! I'm older than you. How do you know that? You don't know how old I am. Well, I know I'm older than you. Why are you, you still in my coordinates? You are in my Yeah, there's coordinates in there. There's oh. coordinates everywhere. I'm real excited about this. This is turning out to be a great day. It Tuna? is a great day. You're right. It is such a great I'll day. I'll go get yes. Fuza. Your mouth. What's, what's your you are illegal here. Name? Get out of Never my house. Have fun with them, Nova. I'm gonna go get Fuza. Why are your eyes different color? Why do you have armor on? Is this world dangerous? Why do you have a shield that's wooden? Why, are you, why do you have a book? Why do you have goggles? Why do you have like, a weird pin? Why is your hair that color? Are you why so do you have annoying? Um, excuse me? I made a wonderful addition to your house, free of charge, by the way. And all I get is a, you're annoying, no thank you, you're welcome. I didn't ask you to build anything on my house. In fact, I'd say you illegally tried to move into my building. No, no. I did not send you a contract. No. This is not no, an air no. B, B, whatever. I'll show you, I'll show, I'll show you. Yeah, actually, please contract. do show me the contract because I can't send things out of here. Here, I can even give you the writing utensil. Here, that was Guys, I've arrived with Fuza. Have you sorted your differences out yet? This is just a piece of paper. Yeah. You've just handed no, me a blank a piece contract. of paper. No, no. You're wrong. It's literally a blank piece of paper. Oh, you whoa, wait. Ugh, ugh. This is Sarita, who apparently illegally tried to move into my house. The sign literally oh. says illegal Airbnb. You literally. Oh, it's not illegal. Then why is there a sign that says it's illegal? I want to go home. <laughs> <What's this? laughs> I know, do you want to go to the counseling room? The what? I have therapy rooms. Ooh, a counseling room? I'll come. Wait, oh, what? God. You have what now? Hey, Nova, yes. I think you need therapy. Because, um, you know how I live, like, just one painting away, and the doors are never closed? Well, you have some pretty bad night terrors. I hear you screaming, kicking, and shouting. Sometimes I even stand on top of you while you sleep. Ryu, you you're gonna kill me! Side. Where did Nova, you go? Ryu, come back to Sorry, me! Drone. Who's a protect what, what me? Who's a protect me? Ooh, and in we go. Ooh, All right. In. in. I can't come come on. in. Oh. Oh, I've already been here. I mean, no, I haven't. Everyone pile in. <laughs> Therapy time. Nope, I'm out. Nope, I'm Nova, out. Nova, 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 you I'm get back here. here right now. No, I'm out of here. I'm Hold out of here. Hold on. I'm out of here. I'm Nova, here. you get back here nope. right now. Nope. Nova, not. when did you build that room? Just come down here, for God's sake. When did sake. you build the room? A few weeks ago. And I've been asleep for how long? Two months. So you built this while I was asleep? Yes. Now can you come down here and stop making a big deal out of it? I Team bonding. No, 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 stop. Stop. stop giving me things. I don't want them. For you. I just feel so bad because of your night care. Serotonin. Oh, yes? Sit in the seat. Do you like to question the serotonin why the heck they're there? When Whoa. exactly did you arrive? Then. That's not a specific date, but oh, I'll take it. Um, Do you know why you're here? Yeah, yeah. I wanted to have a good Airbnb, you know, air brewing and baking. I really wanted to have a good baking experience. But then when I came for some reason, it was like I couldn't get out. Like there was this wall, this invisible wall. It was really weird. Barrier, and I got yes. teleported in there, and it was pretty odd. But you know, besides that, I've been having such a dandy time watching Nova every single night for no sleep. Okay, now I have to ask, why this server specifically? Like, What's is there server? any other server that you could have chosen? What's a server? B-type world, created by a known god and readable code, usually a high magic type so that as many people can join as possible. Currently, we're in a B-10 world. I see. Why this server? Well, um, I can't actually say. Where did you come from before? I'm always, I've always been here. I've always been here. I just was never this form shape with these cool noodles on my, uh, butt. And these cool noodles on my torso, and this cool bobble head on my neck. Okay, um, Nova, do you like to take a seat? I don't want to do this. Do I have? To? I don't want to do this, for you. I'm not doing this. Okay, fine. Fuza, would you like to take a seat? How are you feeling, Fuza? Do you know why specifically? Hey, why didn't you ask me how I was feeling? Because nobody cares. <gasps> because we're trying to figure out why you're here. That's I am why. I'm an important member of society, unlike you. Oh. oh no. Well, I hope all is well. Nova, would you like to take a seat? I would not like to take a seat. Come on. No. We gotta get this done with. Uh-uh. I will fight you. Look, the faster we get this over with, the faster we will fight we've done you. This. Sarita, can you get her in the seat? Can no, you get them no, in the seat, no, please? no. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. Do oh, there we go. Okay, now. 
<laughs> no, but how are you feeling with Serta now being, you know, here in your house illegally? Here's a contract. I don't want your freaking contracts! I'm very pissed the fuck off. Do you feel Stop. like as you've lost your sanity? I lost my sanity a long time ago, but now I'm losing more of it. I'm in the negative. Yeah, I, I help them regain. See, look at us, buddy. Serta, I'm gonna have to ask you to just stand back there. Back here behind Nova. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, in the room would be great. Um, I'm in the yeah, room. Yeah, we can't leave you unsupervised. Did you break the wall? No. Serta, put the wall back now. Mm. So help me. On a scale to one to ten, uh, how bad, how uh, angry are you feeling? Ten thousand. Oh, okay, noted. Good. I think we're done with our therapy session. Thank Group bonding is over with. Thank God. Stop closing doors in my faces. Now everyone, uh, get out of my house. <laughs> We found there's books in my house and there's coordinates in them. They're put in a specific order, so I'm just gonna read them in order. Please, just everyone come sit on the couch. Why is there sand? You. Would you shut up? Just read the books. Okay. Coordinates negative 377, 75, negative 178, and it's signed X. Number two. Coordinates negative 406, 72, negative 307. Answers part two, signed X again. Number three. Coordinates negative 306, 72, negative 365. There's still more for you to learn, my little virus, signed X. And finally, coordinates negative 347, 78, negative 470. Don't say I don't give you answers, X. They're all signed in X. Mm -hmm. Remember when we did the House of Questions? Yeah. You know how the book that led us to the House of Questions was signed in X, right? <gasps> It's the same person. damn person. No, okay, what was the first one? The first one, negative 377, 75, negative 178. We're going to that one then. Uh, Serta, do you want mm. armor? Oh, 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 I stole that. Okay. Serta, you can come, Which? but only if you promise to behave. I've been here this entire time. You're the one not behaving. I'm behaving perfectly fine. You're the one breaking stuff. Where are you going? Where are you I'm going? getting an axe. Oh, you're going to my house? No, I'm going to- It's my house. My house. Your house is I the have. hat, okay? Oh, Your house all. is the hat. And we're building an extra entrance for you to leave so you don't have to go through my house to get in and out. Um, no. Well, too bad, because that's what we're doing. No. Do you want me to evict you? Because I can do that too. Um, I'm going to let you stay here because I don't know where else you would where possibly you go? go. We haven't done the welcome a new member to the SMP ceremony yet. Welcome, everyone of Mayhem SMP. My name's Nova. And today we all have the honor, quote unquote, of welcoming a new server yes! member. An honor! It's an honor! As we all know, okay. new members are few and far between, as well Ooh. as unpredictable, since we don't exactly have control over when it happens. Nevertheless, I'm sure we're all grateful for more company. Please welcome our newest server member, Sarita. Sarita, if you'd like to come up here and say a few words about yourself so we can get to know you better. Hello, everyone. My name is Sarita. And although I hate to be the bearer of bad news, no, no one's dying. No, 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 no. You're supposed to just speak from the heart yeah. about yourself. Um, unfortunately, I've come to your server, and I will be here forever now. And you'll have to live with it, and I know you hate me, but too bad. Also, there's a lot of pollen here, and I'm getting pretty stuffy in the nose. Please, so, please yeah. go sit back down. Thank you very much, Sarita. We're honored Ooh, to have giving. you. If anyone in the group is willing, we can take you on a quick tour of the server. We can do that later. <gasps> and if you need starter supplies, they're along the wall in those chests right uh, over, uh, they're over there. Not there. They're, they're not there. They're on spawn. There. Never mind. They're at they're spawn. spawn. Anyway, thanks for joining us, everyone. And Sarita, welcome to Mayhem SMP. Ooh, it's not. Now do you want to go okay. find the house? I think it's by Gloom's new house, actually. Oh, it's right here! No Gaylord's home. Wait, did she have a graveyard? Uh, no, but there's a book down here. There's a book? Ooh, there's blood in skeletons. If you want, I can put more blood. Can diary of Noel Gaylord. Started out as normal, mining a tree with just her hand to get wood. Making wooden tools after, of course, making a crafting table. Then getting your stone, upgrading your gear again. You get the point. However, things started to get weird. The server at times would not let us out, which wasn't a big deal, seeing as my wonderful admin Lotus would fix it before we could all enter panic mode. But it wasn't just that. Things, animals, and dare I say players would randomly disappear. Some would return, but others would just never come back. Thankfully, no players have stayed missing. Though I can't say the same about animals and objects. I mean, just the other day my cat, Rhino, named because he is gray, went missing. Now I know cats like to go out and explore, and he does that, but he is never out this long. He is always back before dark, just before the sun really goes away for the night. I miss him, and I hope he returns and doesn't stay missing like everything else that we have lost. Anyway, I gotta go. I gotta go get my stuff and head to Hero's. We're going mining. Maybe I'll find diamonds this time. Okay. Hero! 
Hiro and Lotus were also in the graveyard, weren't they? Yes! I feel like they were like close by to each other too. Like their graves were close by. This bed is comfy. Stop sleeping in dead people's beds! Oh no. He's, what? he's dead. Hiro is dead. What do we do? They have taken our admin. There is nothing we can do without her. And now they have killed Hiro all because he opposed them. What if I'm next? No, no, I can't be, right? They they took- who's they? The damn- Kai Lustus? What? Kai Lustus? Kai Lustus, that's Latin. Kai Lustus is a play off the- it sounds like- it's similar, like, um, godly? No, no, that's-, that's Nero's. Celestial! Celestial, that's the English translation. The server is so far gone because of them. Damn it, everything is so fuzzy. I can't breathe. I think they splashed something on me when I was running away. The world is turning. I'm sorry, Jay. Guess you get my stuff after all. I'm sorry. And then it trails off. Band board. Jay. Stealer. Stealer. Um, what was the next one? Negative 406, 72, negative 307. Sarah is asleep. Hold on. Sarah. Oh, so hey, yeah. Yeah, that we was go. so comfy. I just kind of drifted. You know? We gotta go. Where did these come from? They weren't here before, right? Well, just like the House of Questions, they appear overnight, apparently. Where did you guys wood. go? He was also in the graveyard too. There's a, the There's a dog in here. There's a notebook. Dog. I don't usually write mainly because I think I'm no good, but I think writing might help with my issue, or at least that's what Faith recommended. You see, I feel like I'm being watched, but the others just don't believe me. But then again, I can't blame them. I am always blowing something up, bad or setting something on fire. Either way, it feels like there are eyes on me constantly. I just can't shake the feeling. It feels wrong. But there have been a lot of things going wrong lately. The server is glitchy and more laggy than it has been before. Things have gone missing too, and I can't help but think, am I next? It's all so crazy. I just wanted to play a game with my friends. Now it doesn't feel so serene, no longer peaceful. Play a game? This sounds like they came here on their own accord. It's like you wake up somewhere entirely different, like you're walking into a game of death and that's what it's starting to feel like. I mean, just yesterday, Jake came back from being gone for two weeks. He was not like himself. He wasn't the goofy Jay I know. He was quiet, closed off. He hasn't said a word since he came back from wherever he was. I'm worried for him like everyone else, but I don't know what to do. Will he go back to being the same old Jay we all know? I don't even know if that's possible anymore. I mean, he hasn't made a move to steal Noel's stuff yet, and that's what he always does. Those two are always fighting, but I can tell they're good friends. Either way, I hope he feels better soon. Damn it, it's that feeling again. The feeling of being watched. I don't think I'm just imagining it anymore. Buddy, I think, senses them too, the eyes. With every passing day, it's like the feeling grows more and more. They're here. If you're reading this, I've probably been taken. Please take care of my dog, Buddy. If they don't kill him, that is. God, I hope they don't. They're outside my house. I should hide. Maybe they will leave if I'm not here. Is that it? That's it. Well, that's another thing we need to worry about. He said he was being watched. I, who was watching? Like, eyes? What? No, she says something about the Kylestus. This group of people came in and just destroyed their server, basically. Do you think that there's any correlation? We should go see what Also, who's gonna take this dog? Yes, you're mine. Is there anything in, like, any of the chests? Nope. Chests are empty and I'm stuck with the cobwebs. Anyone want a free anvil? <laughs> no thanks. I'd rather not steal from dead people. If they're dead, we don't actually know, to be fair. They could just have been taken somewhere, whatever that means. <laughs> All right, uh, what was the next one? Kiro Shokota. This is Kiro's yeah. house. There's uh, a trap door. I'm the the archive? The archive? No, if I get down. The what? Archive. Can I kill it? <gasps> oh my god. Holy sh- Everything you need to know about potions. Demigods oh, no, my and goddesses. Old language! Entities uh -oh. of- Entity of mother? Code X, oh, no, myth or truth? The god of mayhem and the chaos? The god of mayhem and chaos. Guys, look, there's a funny perfect portal. Um, this looks like the place that was behind the house of questions. Codex Midgard. Demi Goddess. Oh, I just realized house. something. We gotta what? check how many lives yeah. you have. Huh? What? We gotta check up on Sarah's lives. We don't know how many lives she has. Oh, yeah. Hey, Give me what, what five seconds. Holy crap. Sarah, you with 100 lives. What the what that's the what highest that number mean? of the entire server. What does that mean? That means that you can die 100 times before you get, you know, permakilled. Oh yeah, there's a life system. You have like a limited number of lives. And if you lose all of them, you're dead permanently. I'm not sure how I have that many lives. You know, I've died quite a bit. That's why I'm a little wonky in the head. I've, I've died of many traumatic brain injuries. Yeah, I can't see how many lives you've lost. I just know how many you have total. Only you can see how many lives you've lost. Oh. 
one? Yeah, I won't share that. Are you in my vacation? We oh are in my God. vacation home, yes. We've broken in. <gasps> a cauldron. Oh, guys, I'm wet. What? What? Uh, what? <sighs> okay, last one. Oh, I see it. And oh, God. Oh, my God, that's a, a grave. Okay, watch out for the wither no, 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 no. Careful, careful. Sarah, 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 No, 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 no. I like experimenting on my. No, but there's a... No, but there's Wait, a no, no, I wanted to do it. I wanted, I wanted to clean this up. It starts at entry number seven. I can't believe I'm actually doing this, but here goes nothing. This is how a happy, peaceful server turned into a ruined, desolate place. A server that was full of life, stripped of all. All because of them. They are the bringers of destruction. They are people, no, monsters, who think that they can just bend everyone to their will. It's either you join them or die. There is no in between. You can try to outrun them, but they have eyes everywhere. Escaping is a dying dream, just an unreachable freedom. It's a lost cause to run, that's why I submitted. And if you're reading this, then I'm most likely still under their control. That and the machine actually worked, and this book is back on the SMP I came from. Or well, what's left of it. I wonder if you're all still there. If so, and if you're reading this, then hi. Has the grass grown back? Oh, who am I kidding? My friends are dead, or will be soon. That is, if they don't kill themselves first from pure insanity. Either way, I should probably explain how it all got to this point. It all started April 17th, 2020? Well, that year's wrong. It was a Friday morning, warm but not hot. It had been a few hours since everyone woke up, probably somewhere around 11 or 12, I can't quite remember. Lotus was hard at work doing her admin duties. Honestly, how does that woman not get tired of doing the same thing every day? On top of having to deal with us and two two-year-olds, Lark and Howdy, it amazes me to no end, but anyways. Jay, being the ever mischievous gremlin that he is, causing chaos starting arguments with Noel, making moves for her stuff every time she is not looking. Honestly, I'm surprised he hasn't been banned off the face of the server yet. Though I know deep down he is just teasing her because of his crush on her. But you did oh not God. hear that from me! <laughs> oh. Then of course Faith, our beloved healer. Honestly, I love that woman to pieces just because she can heal my wounds. Cause let me tell you, being exploded by a creeper is not fun. Nor is being shot multiple times by a dang skeleton. Or being mauled by a zombie or spider. And don't even get me started on any other hostile mobs. I could go on, but that's beside the point. Everything was as it should have been. Quietude, serenity, and that feeling of being tranquil. That was until they forced their way into the server, right through the firewall. For the, few, for the first few minutes, it was silent, the only sounds being the noise the seven of us made. The rapid tapping Lotus was doing on our comm, trying to figure out who these people were. The slight panic in Noel's voice, asking what the hell was going on. Then there was fire, Whole trees being forced out of the ground and thrown haphazardly. People none of us have ever met before walked towards us from the tree line. They were, to say the least, terrifying. One, a girl, whose name I now know as Ivy, seemed to be the one responsible for the trees. If the glowing green spell circle of arbor magic, or tree magic for those who don't know the old language, was anything to go by. It all went to mayhem and chaos at that, at that point. They forcefully took Lotus away from us, forcing her to comply, scratching her, making her believe that she was weak and wouldn't fight back anymore. Then the first fell. Howdy. One of them stabbed him right in his back and out through his chest. It was a gruesome sight, but it was only going to get worse from that point onward. I don't really remember much after Howdy was stabbed. Well, up until the part where I was trying to flee with Noel, and four of them cut us off before we could escape. I remember one of them stabbing me as I tried to hold them off so Noel could run. I'll never forget the words the dude who stabbed me said. Don't worry about the brunette girl. She'll be dead long before you wake up, scribe. I remember seeing Noel running away as one of the dudes who was chasing her threw a potion on her before backing off, then just black. When I woke up again, I was in an all-white room. It was bright to the point it was hard to keep my eyes open without wanting to close them, kind of like someone was constantly shining a flashlight in your eyes. Before I could fully understand where I was, why I wasn't dead, unless this was where you go when you die, and I doubt it. The sound of a heavy iron door being opened, as well as four people entering the room is what I heard. I also heard the sound of a light switch, right before the light seemed to dim. For the first time since I awoke, I was able to open my eyes and keep them open. I seemed to still be in the same clothes as that day. I still had my satchel with me, with this book of course. I looked up to two things. One, I was no longer on the S&P, but I kind of figured after what that dude said. And two, there were four people in front of me, the three sisters whose names I later find out are Truth Seeker, Endmaker, and Fallacy, What? and their quote-unquote doctor who was a demigod of healing that they somehow managed to willingly make join their side. His name was Cybel, if you're curious. They gave me a choice, though in the end I know they only did it out of pity. I did to see if I fit their standards for what they wanted me to do. So with the last of my pride dissipating, I chose to join them. 
That was the worst decision I have ever made in my life. That and jumping down the huge cave with the others on day two of the SMP. But then again, that doesn't even compare to joining the likes of these monsters. I'm a traitor to my kind, joining the people who killed my friends. Pretty pathetic, right? Yeah, I know. I regret that decision every day of my life. I live with their memories, good and bad, in the guilt. But I shouldn't have to, I never should have to. Because it never should have played out like it did. No one ever chooses to live with the memories and guilt left in the wake of their dead friends. The people who do didn't choose to, they were forced to. If you're still reading this, then I've probably either escaped by now or tried to and died because of it. Listen, you need to stop them. The Kylestis, that's what the three sisters call their group. They will get into every server and force people to join their resistance. They want to get to go, go against the creator of all, Mother Void. I have books that I've written over the years that should still be in the archive that can help you defeat them, or at least give you a winning shot. Just don't walk into the pinkish portal opposite my nether portal. That is a whole nether dimension no one is ready for, at least not yet. If I'm not dead by the time you all find the location of the Kylestis, then maybe save me? Hiroshotika. Th that can't be right! No, that can't- The sisters? Did you yeah. tell me a story about yes, the sisters? Yes, yes, the myth! Okay. Let me explain this, Guzin, you and Guzin Therity, you guys might not know this. There's a myth about the creation of the multiverse, and it features three sisters whose names are Fallacy, Truthseeker, and Endmaker, and they're supposedly the ones who created everything. They created people, they created universes, and Fallacy gave people magic. Supposedly, it's a myth. It's a myth. But this book is making know, it sound I, like it's I, real. I what? No, I know Fallacy. You what? She was the one who taught me magic. <laughs> I'm sorry, the creator of magic taught you magic. Oh yeah, but that was only like a century ago. How? Then she vanished. Yay! How old are she you? She was very nice. I don't know. Uh, 500? Oh, you were older than me, okay. Are the three sisters running the Kylestis? But if they're trying to go against- Who's Mother Void? I've never even- <gasps> Mother! The Entity of Mother. The it's Entity mother. of Mother. There it's was a book in the archive about it. Oh my god, this explains so much. So then she's the evil entity. So then Code ha- Code said that she was evil too. Code mentioned her. So then Code- but then is Code working with the Kylestis? So if 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 Code doesn't like Mother either, then that means either he is working with the Kylestis or there are multiple groups going against this mother person. Or another option, he's being forced to work with them. But he doesn't want to. That's true. But then what do we have to do with any of this? Why are we on the old server? Why does this old server even still exist? If there was nobody here, are we the second group of people to be here? The third? The fifth? And the year that was mentioned, 2020, doesn't even make any sense. We're not anywhere near that year. But we have thousands of years what to year go before. What year is it? It's... 650... 659? 659. How do you know if you just randomly appeared here? Because I know what year it was before we got here, and I'm fairly certain we've been here at least a well, year. How do you know? Because I can read calendars. What if you got transferred to the future? Hmm? Time travel doesn't really- we're all from different time periods, so I mean, it's less of a different time period thing, and more from like, our universes- We all come from different universes, and all those different universes have different rates of, like, uh, technological advancement, so some universes are more advanced than others. But that doesn't necessarily mean they're not all from the same year. How old are you? How old are you? How old is Kuzo? Uh, I don't know, I don't know, and I don't know. You don't know how old I'm... you are? You don't need to know that. Uh, somewhere between 23 and 26, I don't know the exact age. I kind of got my huh. memory wiped when I came in here, but I'm oh, I'm pretty sure that that's not right either. I'm, I'm pretty right. sure I've actually read up on a few things, and dragon hybrids are actually a lot older than they look. Oh, you know when I said 500 and then One second, I'll be right, right back. You've just lived through the creation of the universe, no wonder you fucking know Fallon. Uh, no, the creation of the universe, uh, <laughs> well, that happened before me. But then everything got like, destroyed, but then everything got undestroyed, and then everything got destroyed again, and then everything got undestroyed again, and then, then fallacy, and we were like besties. Then we had fun time. We were in love. Yeah, oh my god. So, you know, I, I, I can't deal evolved. with this. My entire world is getting turned upside down. Oh what my god. Something is very different. What? How much did you build in two and a half months? Oh yeah, that. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, that. Oh, we Good now have you. a full-fledged bakery, a hotel, and a blacksmith. Well, Hello, yeah, welcome to the Lindor Cafe. What permanently. can I get you? Uh... <laughs> I died permanently, but then policy was like, no, no, no. And so I was like, ha ha ha. I and then, Lindor Cafe, what can I get you? Oh, hi. What do we do? What do they expect us to do? We have to get out of here. I, if, we can, if we can escape into an A-type world, maybe we can 
get away. They only said they were attacking servers. So if we're not in a server, then we're safe, right? I, I don't think yeah, that's the case. totally. You totally know how that works. What if we go to the void pocket? Okay, okay look. In all the books that we've read so far, they were all in this oh, server yeah. when it happened. Oh, they don't oh, even know oh. if they can attack other worlds. Oh, they just yeah. said they stated it in their journals. Oh, yes, yes, they can attack Kido. servers. Oh, yeah. They've heard rumors about attacking mm -hmm. servers. We don't mm -hmm. know if they can attack. Mm -hmm. If they can or can attack oh, worlds. Hero literally cool. said that they are working Gosh. with this group and they don't want to be, and that they know they're going to go to every server and find people. We were pulled here against our will for some reason, and this sounds like it probably is the reason. Okay, well, some of us were pulled here for a reason. Penny came, came here, here on her own accord. You came here on your own accord. I... Fuza and me got yeah. dragged here. We don't have any memory of what happened beforehand. You got dragged here, but you do Ooh. have some kind of memory beforehand. These people before us, they came together because they wanted to, and they still got hurt. You know, what I'm saying, because of the books, is that there's another threat that we have to worry about, because, you know, we already have to worry about that voice person, who I don't remember the name was, that friend of yours that we're panicking over. Now we have to worry about the damn Kylestis. We're not a threat to them. Like, we've done nothing to the Kylestis. So they have no reason to just come in here and just, you know, mess everything up. What they... if they made this place specifically for that purpose? What if the whole- just because- not everyone here was brought here for a reason. If you're here and you're stuck here, you're involved now. It doesn't matter whether you wanted to be or not, or whether they put you here. It doesn't matter. We're all involved in this. If we were brought here for a reason, we're all involved in that reason, whether we want to be or not. We have to come up with something we can do. We have to get out of here. You know, I could always do- I could always help. I know things about things about things. Yeah, I mean, if you have ideas. I have so many ideas. I don't know, of course, Fuzo. We don't want to leave Kana behind either. I don't even know where Kana went, because, like, the last time that we saw Kana before, you know, when you left and you were having your whole, like, talk with False, was in the nether and, like, chased after something and we lost them in the nether. Fuzo, is he still here? If he is, then that just completely debunks the whole, like, only one of us from an original server could be here. I don't think that's true necessarily. Are there people yeah, who've gotten in so. here? And we know for a fact that some of us share universes with those people. Guys, what if we could make my witch hat like a secret meeting space? If they have eyes everywhere, I don't think it quite matters. Oh, my hat has a cloak. It can't, you can't hear inside or outside it. It's like a scrambler. Really? Do you have witch magic? Uh, cannot confirm nor deny. I plead the fifth. Do you know? Like, what exactly is the next step? Maybe we could devise some sort of where we have a shift, kind of where we go out like once a week and we look around for any new or suspicious activity in our area. That could work, yeah. Hey, has anyone seen my panda? She can't get out of her enclosure. I don't, I don't want to sound crazy and I don't want to freak anyone out, but this this is kind of like, um... Remember when the book said that things started to go missing? Animals? Pets? I don't want to like panic anyone, but do you think that's happening? Because Pandora should be in our closure. It could be. Sometimes I feel bad about all the things I don't share. We learn so many things together, and I always seem to be the most worried about what could happen. Because a part of me knows what will happen, but I can't tell them. She won't let me. The Kylestis are honestly the least concerning thing about this whole situation. People have died to them, been taken by them, and clearly they are the reason we're here. But what I'm more worried about are how all the things I thought I knew are being turned upside down. The sisters are real people. Sarita, a stranger, knows Fallacy personally and learned magic from her. And I am no longer the only person here who's ever had eyes on their back. She watches my every move. I can't step one foot out of line without fear that she'll come for me. I can't work, and I can't sleep, and I can't save them if I'm exhausted. I can't keep living like this. I have to stop her. And I think the archives can help me. Semper Fidelis, Nova Whitlock.